So within energy transition, a techno-economic feasibility study is an evaluation of the technology that's available on the market today to help companies decarbonize. We do an analysis of both what's technologically feasible and then what makes sense from an economic perspective. And that's important because while solar may be a possibility in one area of the U.S., it's not favorable in another part. Hydrogen might be an available source if a facility is located near one of the hydrogen hubs that are being constructed now, but other areas might at this time be too geographically distant. So with this type of analysis, the amount of carbon that would be reduced in tons per year for the facility is normalized by the cost to implement the technology. So for example, if a facility has a boiler that's fired with natural gas now, one of the alternatives we might look at is renewable natural gas. And is that available in that geographic area as renewable natural gas has less carbon emissions? So if it is available, then we would look at the cost to implement and switch um, any kind of piping or any other types of capital changes and operational changes. So it really helps decision makers at a company normalize the cost per ton of carbon. So you can evaluate and find the most impactful way to spend your money to reduce carbon.